each week of each module has two classes. So class one, the life skill is black belt, excellent mindset. And class two, adversity introduces us to ourselves. Good stuff. So what do we do with it? Okay, we're gonna download the file, just like you see it here, and then upload it to Canva. Canva is a super easy graphic design program that you must get at least your green belt in because it's that super duper easy and it's free. I'm gonna take you through that in just a second, but first, here we go. So underneath each life skill, you see the download. Download adversity, download black belt. Let's download black belt. Let's download adversity. So I'm in Canva, and this is where we design a lot of this stuff because it's that easy. So to give you an idea, and we're going to jump to what you'll be doing in just a second. But first, this is let's just imagine that we downloaded this and we brought it in. So we downloaded it from the lesson plan like I just showed you, and then you imported it into Canva. And the way you do that is over here on Projects, click on this, create a folder of your life skills or empower kickboxing life skills, whatever you want to call it, and then you import them into here. So this is live text, so I can move it around. I can edit it. Do, 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 do. I mean, that's it. Everything's right here, depending on the amount of space you have. So this is pretty spacious. It's going to be this little, little crowded up at the top here. We want to have breathing room at the top. You can move it around any way that you want you can put your logo and information right above it, or better yet, use this space for your logo and information, and then put a testimonial right here. Now, some will have more room than others, but all in all, pretty much have enough room to do what you need to. Now here, we ran out of room, so you make a decision over here, and, and there's enough room here to put both in, but here's a, watch this, I can just, crop this a little bit. Now, I don't want to crop it too much because I'll lose the wrist grab. And I don't want to crop it too much because I'll cut her head off. But her head is not that important because the focus is on the smile and the smile and the wrist grab. So we're going to push that to the top. Bang! Now we have plenty of room. So that's how you prepare the life skills to upload to your social media. And you go to share. You want to download it. But be careful right here because I have 46 of these in here, and I could accidentally download all of them, which means nothing other than it's just a waste of time. You could just trash them right away. So you want to make sure you deselect and then cruise through and pick out the one that you want to download, which I forgot it, which one it was, <laughs> not that it really matters. But anyway, pick one out, and then you want to download this. And I suggest that you use the PNG. PNG is a file that is a little larger than a JPEG, but it has better results. It's more resolution, so it, it's not as washed out as JPEGs can become. And you can control that even further right here with the slider. You can make it really big, but anywhere right around there, and ignore either both of these guys, you hit download. Then you go to your Facebook and you have a couple of options here. One, you could upload it right here to your home. That's the feed that your, your friends all see. But it's better to use, or actually you could do this and go into one of your pages and upload it. The process is the same thing. It's going to ask you this. You want to upload a photo. Our students are learning how to deal with adversity this week. Empower our students are learning how to deal with adversity in our Empower Kickboxing class this week. Cool, that's it. Maybe you could pop that down. A little bit of a take a look at it. It looks good. In Canva, again, this would be filled in already because you dropped in your own logo, your you want your logo, your phone number, and your website, and then a testimonial from a student would be great on the ones you can fit it in. Notice how I capitalized the first letter of each word. That makes it a lot easier to read and remember, so don't forget that. Hit post. 
And there it is. Da -da -da -da. How about that, ladies and gentlemen? So I'll start getting comments on this thing <laughs> pretty dang soon. So I hope you followed that. I know I'm I'm not the I'm definitely not an A3 black belt in teaching computer skills and graphic design. But my first art director was actually an eighth degree black belt, maybe a tenth degree black belt in art design. And he helped me a lot. I, I sat at the foot of the master. He was the Joe Lewis of design for magazines and for this kind of stuff. So I've learned a lot and I'm passing it on to you. Hope that helps. If you have any questions, please let us know. Thanks so much for watching.